hi guys welcome back to my channel um if this is your first time stopping by you're welcome my name is success aka success by and i welcome you especially to this channel so today i'll be teaching us how to make catfish pepper soup so if you're interested in learning how to make fresh catfish pepper soup stay tuned first of all let's go to the market to get a fresh catfish so people call it point and key so let's go point key and bring it to the kitchen mm -hmm. to our kitchen so um we're still going to get um spices that we'll be needing spices and other things that we'll be needing all right guys let's get going okay guys so this is the cast fish that we got from the market i told them to cut it i, I got just one because it's just me all right so i told them to cut it in four in four pieces in four places so this is the catfish that we got all right so let's go down to business okay guys these are the spices that we'll be needing for this recipe these two right are the two major spices that we'll be needing for this recipe for this pepper soup and cartridge pepper soup recipe right so this is dried um grounded pepper this is salt and this is meat spice this one i don't really know what the english name is but in my local dialect is called osmada so this is scotch bonnets um we're adding this scotch bonnets this seasoning cube that we'll be using for this recipe and then this um the scotch bonnets with this crawfish now and i'm adding just this um cup of water this one cup of water okay i added just one cup of water right to read but i don't think this one cup i added will be enough so i'm adding a half cup of this again so yeah The grounded pepper, the grounded pepper, the mixed spice we're going. The mixed spice and this um, osmada we're going. In fact, everything here will be going in right now. Okay, so first of all, you're adding the grounded pepper then the mixed spice and the osmada spice and the socks but i don't think i'll be adding everything one thing about cooking is if you don't want to make mistakes all right just add your 
your salt small like when you want to add salt just add little quantity so now i'm going to divide the salt add half of it later i will taste if it's not enough i'll add more so i'm just going to divide the quantity of the salt divide it into two and add half of it uh, so I added half of it. Now I'm going to add this stock cube to it. Let me just break. Okay. So right now I'm going to blend this scotch bonnet, the scotch bonnet and the crayfish together. The reason I added dried pepper dry grounded pepper but i want to add scotch bonnet the reason i'm adding this two is to enhance the flavor right so The water has been boiling for like three minutes now and it's time for us to introduce the fish so guys the head will be going in first we'll put the head first then allow it to cook for some time for like a minute before we come back to introduce the rest of the fish so we're just going to cover now then come back after one minute so this is after a minute and we are going to introduce the rest part of the fish I'm just going to flip the head then start introducing the head the sorry start introducing the the rest of the fish all right guys if you are enjoying this process please give this video a thumbs up and yeah subscribe please do subscribe to my channel all right hit the notification bell to get notified whenever i drop a new video mm -hmm. all right so now um we are going to cover cover it and come back after three minutes so this is after three minutes and it's time for us to add the scotch bonnet that we blended blended with the crawfish. Um I got two I got two leaves. So um this is Utazi leaf and this is Uziza leave. So we are going to take small quantity from here and small quantity from here. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So this is the outcome of the whole process. This is our pepper soup. It's ready, right? The pepper soup is ready so i'm just going to take a spoon out of it mm -hmm. it's looking yummy and it tastes so nice so delicious i'm not even kidding guys like try it out try it out so guys i'm going to take a spoon Mm. 
Mm. It actually tastes so good. It tastes so good, guys. So the thing is, I don't even know what to take to have this um this delicious pepper soup. It's if I should go get agidi or I should boil white rice. I'm confused. <laughs> Like I, I tasted it and I feel like tasting it more, like eating more of it. So guys, if you are yet to subscribe, please subscribe. All right, hit the notification bell to get notified whenever I drop a new video. And um, yeah, drop a comment in the comment section below. Like and share. So I'll see you in my next video. Peace out. Love you guys.